everybody, it's Brett, and it is uh, October 23rd, 2023, and we're going to do uh, the afternoon Monday lot walk. We didn't get to it this morning because it was raining and kind of crappy weather. And uh, I got one of our product specialists, sales consultants here. This is Jesse. How do you say your last name, Jesse? How's it going, everybody? I'm Jesse Selecta. Selecta. Yep. Okay, so Jesse Selecta. Jesse, how long you been here? Uh, a little over a year. You're in about three, four months. Awesome. Yeah, so Jesse was our all pro last month. He uh, sold pretty much most vehicles and, you know, helped out a lot of customers and really did a great job last month. And that gets them all pro. Uh, but we're going to go through all the vehicles that came in over the weekend and some of the stuff that came in last week as well. And uh, Jesse, what's uh, what can you say about the inventory that just kind of came in? It's that, awesome. I mean, that's what is the biggest bonus, you know, about working here. It's great, great customers, great people, and, and it all helps and kind of brings everybody together. Everything together, obviously, having the inventory we do, yeah, uh, we it got, keeps everything going. Got a ton of stuff in, a lot of heavy-duty trucks. Uh, Dooleys and diesels and you know just a lot of really you know stuff that people need you For know sure. and uh, I've been here almost 10 years over 10 years maybe 11 years anyways but uh, we've always had really really good inventory I think that's what sets us apart from a lot of our competitors but uh, we're gonna get right to it uh, we actually just got one just dropped off right here so let's go check that out this is a 2021 Ram 3500 Bighorn Level 2. It's got 27,000 miles on it. 22 inch uh, hostile wheels on it. Looks really good. Nice leveling kit on there. And uh, that's going to be a really nice ride. Yeah, Delmonico Red. Yep. Jesse's favorite color. Looks really good on these ones. And Jesse, I like that you're a car guy. What, oh, kind, yeah. of, what kind of car you drive? Uh, I've got a Challenger Hellcat that I drive a lot of the time. And then, you know, Ford Taurus, I'll drive. For work a lot but yeah I, I definitely love my hellcat awesome <laughs> big car guy yeah i've got i've got a gt500 so we'll have to race sometime <laughs> anyways uh right here we've got a 2022 ram 3500 this is a limited longhorn it's got 23,000 miles on it this was a trade-in this is a one owner trade-in uh diamond black's the color it's in it's really dirty but it's in really nice condition uh inside and out and we're going to get that rolling. Dooleys always take a little bit longer to get through the detail process just because we can't take them through the car wash and whatnot. Yeah. And speaking of heavy duty trucks, here's a 2021 F350 XL STX. This is carbonized gray metallic. This one has 47,000 miles. We're going to have to do tires at least in the front on this one for sure. But I didn't see any dents. I didn't see any dings. So it's kind of like the base level work truck but really nice condition on this one. And this one right here is a 2022 Bighorn Level 1, nice. and it's only got 690 miles on it. Wow. <laughs> I mean, like, where do we get some of this stuff? Isn't it crazy? Yep. So anyways, so that thing's pretty much perfect, and we'll be getting that rolling here today as well. This is a 2019 GMC Sierra 1500 Elevation uh, Crew Cab. It's got the six and a half foot box. And this one has 31,000 miles on it. Silver steel, metallic. At least that's a GM uh, Chevy color. And I like the light bar on it, it's pretty cool. Yeah, it's, it's really nicely set up. The elevation gives you the blacked out wheels and the grill and everything. Um, so we'll be getting that rolling today as well. I'm gonna save that truck for the end because that thing's super special. It's a good one. Uh, this is a regular cab long box that we just took in trade. It's got, I think it's 98,000 miles on it. Uh, it's a tradesman, and I, th I think it's a diesel. Yeah, so regular cab regular long cabs, box. Yeah, yeah, for sure. That's pretty cool. This is an 18 Expedition we just got in. 68,000 miles. It's a limited. It's got the second row bench. Those are always nice vehicles to have. Super and then this nice. one just came in too. Not sure if we're going to be keeping this one. It's got some damage. Not sure if we knew about that. But uh, the box side uh, had a little bit of yep. damage there. So, uh, But anyways, this is a 17. And it's got, I think, 79,000 miles or 70,000 miles. Rear bumper's dented. But other than that, it's LTZ, so it's in really... Yeah. really loaded up and it's got a lot of nice options other than the driver's side box got a little bit of damage there but that's how they come in we, they can't all be perfect yep, for when, sure. they're, when they're used this is a seven no a 14 gmc acadia this is an sle it's got all-wheel drive 
and this one has 95,000 miles on it and I kind of just drove it around a little bit yesterday to park it no check engine lights or anything so I oh, think this will nice. actually be a, a keeper that we can uh, retail nice trade-in always nice to get those in this is a Grand Cherokee from a couple a couple weeks ago that's got like 90 no, 127,000 miles. Anyways, as soon as it's through the shop, I'm sure it'll be sold. That's a good one. And uh, what else did we get in today? I think that's it for this row. I wanted to go over a couple vehicles that we got in over here. Ah, it's gone already. They go so fast, like there's so many moving parts to everything that yep. we do here. A lot of cars. Right here, we've got a 2020 Ram 1500 Bighorn. This one came in last week. This is a level two, so it's got the heated seats. That's a really 92,000 miles. This is a prime piece of yeah. uh, inventory That's here. It seems like, our, seems like our half ton Rams have just been flying. Yeah. And it's in really nice condition too. Decent tires, interiors really clean. I think it's a one owner as well. This Durango is actually through the shop. We're going to be keeping that. That's a really cool one too. Yeah, I like that one a lot. It's got some really, really kick-ass exhaust. Uh, is this the Laramie Sport Ison? No. That's a that's a Bighorn, I think. Night edition. That thing's sweet. That just got through the shop. Yeah, is. Nope. This just got through the shop. That'll be a great. Uh, I think it's 14.9 or 13.9. Yeah. Ford Escape. Always. That was on one of the previous videos. Oh, we almost missed it. This Corvette. That stands out. How do we miss that? <laughs> I don't know. Z06. Z06, 1LZ, Chevrolet or Corvette Competition Yellow That's is the really color. Cool one. It's got 13,000 miles and it is a seven speed manual. Oh, that's nice. So yeah. I would imagine if this was. Uh, April or March or June, this thing would be sold already. Uh, just seems like that time of the year is when people buy these things. But that thing's absolutely perfect, 13,000 miles. I'm sure, it's still that gonna go fast, be, yeah. That will be a very nice piece. Is this the one? Here it is 2021 Ram 3500 Laramie Sport. This one has the Ison heavy duty transmission, Cummins diesel, high output and a really, really a nice truck. That is. And that one has 40,000 miles. I actually think it's through the shop already. Wow. They've been uh, they've been cranking and them through. And that's Delmonico red paint color. <laughs> yep. Looks really good. This is a nice piece, Jesse. We just took this one in a trade. This is a 2020 Ford Explorer. It's an XLT, but it's got leather. It's got the quads. It's got some really nice tires on it, some Michelin tires. And it's a one owner. We sold it down in Beaver Dam and actually they traded it in up here. So okay. a really nice yeah, piece awesome. there. And I think that's pretty much everything that came in. There's a couple that are we're still processing in the shop. Um, but I wanted to go to this last one because I wanted to save this is for last oh, yeah. because we don't get these in very often. And when they do, they're pretty much the hottest thing ever. So this is a 2012. Ram 3500, it's a Laramie Longhorn. It's a mega cab, yeah. short box, dual rear wheel. And it's loaded, it's got nav, moon, heated cooled seats, and it's got the Cummins diesel. Mm -hmm. And it's in the very rare sagebrush pearl. Yeah. And this truck is just about mint. It's got very new tires on it. Probably one of the cleanest 2012s left out there. It's a one owner from Maryland. And it's got 64,000 miles on it. Just a, just a really nice piece. So as you can see, we got a lot of heavy duty trucks, a lot of SUVs, and we are completely full, which is great for Jesse. It's right? exciting for sure. Yep. Um, you got a couple sitting too, right, Jesse? You got the Yep, I've got a few. The Challenger, that, yep, the Challenger is going in a couple days. I've got a customer picking that one up, the black Yukon next to it. Um, yep. There's a Ram over here in the corner. Yeah, there's, we have, we're doing pretty good. It's a good month so far. Good month. Uh, we got to finish strong. We got one week left, but that's okay. We got Friday, Saturday, Wednesday, you know, all usually yeah. pretty good days. Thursdays are usually pretty good. And we got Monday next week yet too. Yep. So uh, really excited about that. And hopefully we can uh, finish strong. I hope everybody out there is going to finish strong too. And uh, if you need any information on these vehicles, 
First of all, they're linked in the description below. And if you want to get any information on him, call Jesse. His email is... Uh, it's jesse, J-E-S-S-E, at summitauto.com. Yeah, email Jesse on any of the vehicles that you see here. He'll get right back to you. He's one of our best. Glad to have him aboard. And thanks for checking out the lot walk with me today, Jesse. Hey, Brett, thanks for having me. Yeah, we'll, we'll do it again next week. And if you're not too busy, hopefully you are too busy to do it. And <laughs> I'll just have to do it by myself. But anyways, have a great day. And uh, finish strong, everyone. And go check us out at summitauto.com. Dot com.